Hey there, everybody. We are making a video real quick about our birthday circuit. So students are using these nice, beautiful boards and a CMOD S6 chip. Um, that is a programmable logic chip. And so for this assignment, students are, once they have finished on multi-SIM, they are um, taking a screen grab of multi-SIM and then they are also sending me the file. So I'm going to uh, show you one student's work right here. Uh, so this student took a uh, screen grab and then he sent me this. Now the reason why I'm asking students to send me their files is because their multi-SIM on their computers does not have the uh, proper transfer. So you'll have something that looks like this and when you send it to your teacher, uh, he or she will kind of just go through it with you, make sure everything works, but you've, as a student, have already checked it and it's working. So then we're going to go to transfer up here and export to PLD. And then we're going to uh, hit the first checkbox and we need to uh, hit the refresh button. And we also need to hit these three dots in the bottom corner here and change this to S6 and hit open and then we're going to hit finish where it will then send it to it now i've already done that because then the next few steps takes about three or four minutes that will then lo start loading once you hit uh finish it will start loading through your wire that's plugged into uh your computer right there and it will run now this chip does not have storage so you've got to make sure that you're powered and you're powered on here to actually test it. Now, uh, in here, we'll have the switches that will display um, the birthday, and uh, the students will go through and make sure that all works. So, just wanna make a quick two minute video on why you're sending me the file, how to transfer the stuff, and then uh, remind us that uh, have this powered on and it transferring the file. I already made the, made the mistake once of not having it powered on and it doesn't store it. So, all right, good luck. And let me know if you have any questions.